Three days out from Game 1 of the NBL Grand Final Series, Perth Wildcats coach Rob Beveridge is battling the flu. The Wildcats host the first match of the three-game series against the Wollongong Hawks on Friday night and Perth says it's a must-win game. Rob Beveridge kept his distance from the team at Wildcats training today, but the players say the coach's sickness won't affect their grand final preparation. He seemed fine today. I'm sure he'll be ready. What does a coach do anyway, really? <laughs> Perth has had plenty of time to prepare for the Hawks. The Wildcats haven't played for a week after a clean sweep in their semi-final series against the Gold Coast last Tuesday. You can look at it both ways. Look, we're fresh, we're injury free. They've had six days off, so I don't think it's a, a huge, you know, huge difference. Wollongong has surprised many by making it to the grand final. The Hawks have lost just one match at home all season and the Wildcats know they can't afford to lose at home before travelling to Wollongong for game two. If you can get that first game, the pressure's back on them. Uh, if they get the first game, all the pressure's on us. So. Well, if it takes three games, it takes three games. You know, I'm not going to jinx ourselves and say we're going to do it in two or they're going to do it in two. Friday's match will be Catalini's 450th in the NBL after he started at Perth in the early 1990s. Who wouldn't want to win a grand final? I mean, at any stage in your career, it'll be, you know, even more special for me coming back to Perth this year, you know, possibly finishing off a career on it. Catalini and Young hope their experience will help some of the Wildcats' younger players who are yet to experience a grand final. Blake Kagi, ABC News.